Well, we're counting down to the 49ers preseason football. The Niners face off against the Packers at Levi's Stadium tomorrow. And you can only catch that game right here on KPX5. And Trey Lance is taking over as the new starting quarterback for the 49ers. But years before his football career took off, those who grew up with him say he was a kind and caring kid, always smiling and a joy to be around. KPIX5's Max Darrow has the story from Trey's hometown of Marshall, Minnesota. Before Trey Lance became a name that people all over the country would know as the starting quarterback for the San Francisco 49ers, those who watched him grow up say he was always just a good kid from small town USA. In the tight knit town of Marshall, Minnesota, you'll find families like the Claiths and the Polieskis who are proud to show off their 49ers jerseys. Best of luck, Trey. You're going to do great. Love you, buddy. They've all known Trey Lance since he was a little boy, who, by the way, always seemed happy with a football in his hands, at least in the photos and video his parents shared with us. I love this. I always wanted a new football. <laughs> Trey and his brother Bryce met the Claith and Polieski kids in elementary school at the Holy Redeemer Catholic School. They were making cards for something. Um, Trey there, my necklace here. The Polieskis also lived across the street from the Lances, and the girls say they played with the Lance boys every day. Trey and Bryce were kind of just like another set of older brothers for me. I remember growing up with Trey, if it was more of a Carly day and I was picking the activities, we were baking and hanging out inside watching movies. But if it was a Trey day, we were watching Xbox, playing basketball out in the front yard and just having fun. From elementary school through high school, Trey played on a lot of teams with Mark and Missy Claith's kids. Here's my son, Nicholas, which was one of his wide receivers. Here he is connecting with Nicholas for a touchdown. Trey is probably one of the nicest young men that we knew growing up. Uh, very polite, very cordial, got along with everybody, liked to have fun, had a big smile all the time. From the parents' perspective. They, they grow up so fast and things change. So when I look at these things, I just smile. The Claiths say they always appreciated how kind Trey was to his friends and still is. This photo was taken shortly after Trey was drafted by the 49ers. Very humble kid, very kind kid, always concerned for others, a very good friend to everybody, you know, all the way through from when he was little to today. Jim and Gail Polieski couldn't agree more. He just really looks out for others and he truly has happiness when others are successful. That's a really cool thing. There's no question Trey has found success so far. And along the way, the Claiths and the Polieskis say he's always stayed true to the Trey they've known and loved for many years. There's a few things that I think have stayed the same and they're my favorite things about him. I mean, he's always been very confident and he's always been very intentional about, you know, being caring with the ones he loves and he's always been goofy and I don't think he's lost that which has been really cool. I feel bad calling him a kid um, but he will always be a kid. He will be our kid um, in this neighborhood. No matter how big he's gonna get still is very humble loves his friends and they're all excited to see him shine in a 49ers uniform as the starting quarterback all the way from Marshall, Minnesota. Is a guy who really works hard, takes it very seriously, and will always strive to do his best. He's gonna embrace that whole Bay Area. Take it in. It's gonna be a ride. He's so supportive of everyone, and he's going to love on your guys' community. You're getting the best we've got. From Niner Nation in Marshall, Minnesota, Max Darrow, KPIX 5.